hello everybody welcome or welcome back to my channel today we are going to create a spread for 16th and 17th of october so usually i would pre-decorate a spread so that i don't have to create or spend more time whenever I want to journal but I haven't really done any spreads for a long time because I was so busy so today I decided to create a spread for the 16th and 17th of October and as you can see here I am using this blue um, stickers and ephemera as our color scheme or theme for the spread so I hope you join me and I hope you will enjoy it So here I am drawing a circle and then I'm going to shade the fonts or the lettering around it so it looks like it's a semi-circle and then I'm going to also write the dates inside the circle. So I don't know if it makes sense but you'll see later. Also, I'm choosing the fonts that I am going to use for this spread and I wanted to use a bigger uh, font but I don't have a big font so I have what I have is um, an A6 size font and a 5 size font and usually it doesn't make any difference when it comes to the sizes of the fonts but yeah so here I am drawing the C in the middle so make sure that or I make sure that the lettering is in the center of the circle. So the pens that I am using are the vintage pens which is kind of a dope for the Sarasa or the zebra Sarasa pens and also I'm using the zebra Zarasa pens as well so these are all my favorite uh, pens I haven't really bought any new pens um, in a long time because I just wanted to um, use up all the pens that I have and then I still have refills as well so I'm happy with the pens that I'm currently using so I don't have any motivation to buy new ones so as you can see here, I decided to use the photo from the packet of the sticker so that the photo is larger than the date. Then I decided to use this ephemera. I actually got this two years ago and I saw this one in one of my um, stationary uh, pouches and then I decided okay I'm just gonna use this for today's spread and um, use up all of this because I totally forgot that I have all this um, ephemera and I think I have five different kinds and themes that I haven't used for a long time so 
as much as possible I will use up all the stickers that I have before I get to buy some new ones otherwise I'll just go to waste and I will forget about them Again, shading the day so this is for Wednesday and then I'm going to create another spread for today which is October 17th Thursday and then I'm going to use this last two stickers in today's spread so <laughs> I am finally or I am happy to have finally used up one a pack of stickers because usually I get anxiety <laughs> especially when I think of okay uh, what if I want to use the same stickers and it's not available anymore and I wanted the stickers but then I realized okay I'm just gonna use up everything and then buy another one if um, there's nothing available of the same kind I'm just gonna go and move on and use another design or a different kind of stickers so <laughs> I am also starting to use my washi tapes again and I don't know if you notice but I don't usually use washi tapes in my spreads but i am fond of buying them especially if it's on sale or if there's a big discount but i don't use them so i have like a box of them lying around so i just decided to incorporate more washi tapes into my spreads and enjoy them And then I am going to draw some columns so that the spreads or the page is even, especially if I write the text. Okay, so on to the next spread. So this is 17th of October and I am going to draw the circle and then the dates. And then I am going to use the last sticker from this packet. And then more girl stickers. So these are all my favorite girl stickers. And as you can see, most of my spreads, I usually um, use girl stickers because it kind of like represents me in a way. <laughs> so I am going to shade the days of the week here. So it's Thursday and then I'm going to shade, shade, shade and one of my favorite thing to do is to shade because like i always said it calms me down and then again i'm going to draw the columns so that if i would write the text it's even and the spread looks organized And then I'm going to use this transfer sticker. So um, this is my last sheet of transfer stickers. I've been trying to look for them online, but the, all the shops that I saw, they're all sold out. And I don't know, maybe I'm just gonna wait for, for it to be available again but I love this transfer sticker so oops <laughs> I think I just pulled the stickers off or the sheet off without rubbing it so I need to rub it first to make sure that it's securely or that it sticks to the paper 
and then make sure that when you pull it out it doesn't come off so yeah Usually it would take me 30 to 40 minutes to complete a spread and that also depends on um, if I have an idea what theme I'm going for and also what my spread would look like but um, if I'm kind of playing and I don't have any specific theme, it would usually take me longer. Like for this spread, at first I kind of decided to limit myself to a certain uh, theme, like just use whatever stickers and ephemera I have and then stick to the blue color scheme but then later I decided to incorporate more stickers and these are the stickers that I just got and these are pet stickers I believe and they're actually for skateboards and for water bottles and for luggages and canisters but I think they're gorgeous and I just use them in my journals. So these are my stressless cards. Usually I use them whenever I'm stressed and I don't know what to do. So I use this as a guide. So today I'm going to pick one card from here and then we're going to use it as a journal prompt. 
Okay, so this one says, try as often as possible to pick out words that are positive even if you are stressed and feel negative. Try to think about nice things to say to people in different situations. When interactions make us feel good, it lowers our blood pressure and calms down our heart rates and reduces the amount of stress hormones in our body. Okay, so then another card says, breathe power. It says, close your eyes and breathe normally. Whenever breathing in, imagine breathing in power and good feeling. You can imagine the power you're breathing in with a color or a light. Breathe this way for 5 to 10 minutes. Every breath charges you like you charge your phone. So those are our spreads for today and thank you for joining me and I hope you had a wonderful time and I will see you later.